To mark Breast Cancer Awareness Month, one Charleston woman is making it her mission to increase awareness about breast reconstruction. 13 News reporter Haley Kostick joins us now with a special story of one survivor's comeback. Jennifer and Rob, forget any stigma or stereotype you may have about tattoos for a moment. This kind of ink helps women heal. All right, you ready? Sure, go ahead. Head at it. Marnie Russ Meyer's line of work is a little unorthodox. She restores natural beauty to women who have had breast reconstructive surgery with 3D areola tattooing. I think it's just being able to look in the mirror and see yourself as you were. Yeah. Denisa was diagnosed with ductile carcinoma in 2017 and had a double mastectomy that ravaged her breasts. In 2013, Marnie also had her breasts removed preventatively after discovering she has BRCA, often called the breast cancer gene. It's amazing because I'm giving something back that somebody lost, that I know how it feels, and it's just the best feeling in the world. Sometimes I think it fulfills me more than it does them, but I don't know. The confidence Denise lost slowly resurfaces. Oh my gosh, that looks so good. Oh, well, I'm not done yet, girl. Oh, but it just keeps getting better and better and better. Uh -huh. You're amazing. You might think this tattooing would be done in private, but it isn't. The open door represents an open invitation to other cancer survivors. I've gone 34 years without <laughs> that, you know, so I'm very interested. After two hours of pins and needles, Denisa finally sees the old her. <laughs> Our happy tears are like awesome. I actually have breasts again. That's like awesome. Thank you so much. You're well. <laughs> You're so sweet. <laughs> There should also be a reminder for women to not skip out on annual exams and take the proper preventative measures to reduce your risk of breast cancer. Jennifer and Rob, back to you. Haley, thanks so much. We have more information about cosmetic tattooing on our website. Just go to WWKTV.com.